Hello, today's devotional can be found in the topical index under the word unspeakable. Many see and, un and hear unspeakable things, and, and this is in reference to 3rd Nephi, chapter 26, verse 18. Not everything that God reveals to us can be talked about. And it's not because God wants to keep secrets from people or wants to encourage people to keep secrets from one another. It's because that some things are so sacred that discussing them would just destroy them of their sacredness and it would really make it seem less important than it really is. And a lot of people wouldn't understand certain things anyway because they themselves are not spiritually prepared to and they would mock it. And so it's just better not to talk about some things outside of sacred places. And God wants us all to have knowledge. God wants us all to become wiser, but he's not going to force anybody to go and seek knowledge that they are not prepared to really listen to and work to understand. God loves us all and he wants us to succeed, yes. But he's not gonna throw things at us that we're clearly not ready for or that we don't want in our lives. When people have not made the effort to prepare to hear and understand about sacred things, the Lord is not going to expose them to sacred things. And he encourages others not to expose the unprepared to sacred things because such sacred things would only seem foreign to the unprepared. And that's why the Lord often prepares us with knowledge before he exposes us to sacred things so that we don't become overwhelmed by it and lose the enjoyment of participating in the sacred things. And simply put, certain things should not be talked about outside of sacred places simply because who would understand it except those who prepared and those who haven't prepared would find it weird and they would try to mock it, and they would mock the people for talking about those things, and a lot of contention would arise simply because those who don't understand what is being talked about would want to, and they would express the feelings of being excluded, and they would protest that life isn't fair and God doesn't care about them simply because they're excluded from the information. So it's just better to keep things sacred than to create contention by desacredizing things. Certain things are kept sacred to protect them from the mockery and scrutiny of the world. And if we don't care about these sacred things enough to protect them, then the Lord will not give us anything else that's sacred and he will maybe take our blessings away that are related to those sacred things that we violated. So we have to be careful when things are not to be spoke of, don't speak of them. Preserve their sacredness. And with that said, I love you all so very much and I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.